corporate responsibility is is critical, Mm -hmm. not just in that financial sector, but how important is your understanding of the financial crime landscape in conjunction with other areas such as sustainability and human rights, et cetera? Because to me, you can't really look at any of those in silo anymore. They have so many joint implications. Yeah, I think, yeah, you're absolutely right, Michelle. You, you can't really. And I think that's where a joined up collaborative approach is usually required. I think if you look at it from the ESG lens, G being the governance side, that's really where I would see financial crime in that respect really kind of sitting. Um, but financial crime in itself, I mean, you know, th- those are kind of more predicate offences, right? The human trafficking, modern slavery aspects, financial crime and money laundering in particular is just the kind of the follow on um, piece from that. Um, it's It's really a case of coordinating more than anything else if i if i talk from a Beasley perspective um you know esg is is high on the agenda for us um you know we've we've recently introduced heads of social impact as an example to look at our societal aspects of that under, under modern slavery and 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 um and and you know those kind of topics and those areas but it, it's something that it's not going to work as an organization if you if you look at this in silo and and similarly with the data as well thank you i appreciate that